make sure you clean up, put all this away, blow it out, brush it out if you get a brush with it, or just run the cones through it, get rid of those heads of the build up in there. You can take it apart if you like, so maybe get a Phillips head screwdriver just in case you need to clean out in here or something goes wrong. And I might do that in a later video for you, for one part. Why not? And you can also get cordless versions. And just make sure they go away. Okay, so now you've had your hair cut, you probably want to put something in it. Um, I'm a big fan of V05 hair gel. So I'll just get the water warm first, or have a shower, and then I'll wash it through, and then I'll put a tiny little bit of hair gel in there. Um, but I was going to wait till after the shower. So bear with me through shaving with bad hair. Now I would suggest because you're at home, probably just jump straight in the shower, get all this hair off you somehow, um, and just have a shower and get changed. Otherwise you'll be itchy all day. So do it first thing in the morning before you have a shower, or do it late at night before you have a shower for bed. And also, don't be scared to cut the kids' hairs. I've cut Kobe's hair a few times. Um, he does complain, but he's going to complain here or at the hairdressers. So just give it a go, take your time, and see how it works out the first time. And it, it does take about three, two to three days to blend right in and get a bit of regrowth back. So. Ah, so you've had a shave, now you probably want to go some shaving balm or some shaving cream. So just open it up, just a little bit, dab it on your fingers. Rub it in, and then just rub it on your face, so it moisturises your face, makes it feel a bit fresher. A little bit nicer, doesn't matter if you get your forehead or your cheeks or your nose. Just make sure you get it everywhere. A little bit more, put a bit more on. A little bit more, put a bit more on. So we've had a haircut, we've had a shave, we've jumped out of the shower. So now what do we do? We're going to put some hair gel in our hair. You could use wax, hair gel, hair spray, a bit of water, totally up to you. But I use V05 hair wax, mega hold. Last all day, good stuff. And for my beard, I'll get into that in a minute. Um, so I like to wet my hair with a bit of warm water first if it's totally dry. If I'm just out of the shower, I might just put the hair gel straight in. But just for this video, we'll wet the hair. Just a little bit of moisture. Dry the hands off. Brush it through so it's not dripping. Now you just want to put your fingers and get a little dab, a little dab dab of some hair gel. Rub it through your hands. Let's get it and put it straight through. This was probably a bit much, a bit of a wet hold. As you can see, it's strong enough to keep it all standing up. Your hands off again, dry, otherwise, you make your hairbrush all sticky. You go to the back, look, you go to the front, look, you go to the side, side, look, and you brush it back through. Hmm. And shiny. I don't know, it might be a bit too much. That I don't need. My hands are not too bad. Probably need another quick rinse, quick wash with soap, quick dry off. Apart from that, that's pretty good. Now, what do I do for my beard? Hmm. Hmm. All right. So I've got argon oil, it's beard oil, hair treatment, hydrates and conditions. 
bead. So we just put a smidgen of that on. So you just comes with like a little dripper. Just drip one, drop one. Put it through your hands or your fingertips. And then throw it in. It smells really nice. I wouldn't go drink in the bottle, but I'd stress if you get it on your lips. Yeah, it does feel weird at first. If you're not used to putting that on, just test a little bit, a bit worried about it. Try that testy oil out of your hands, because it's horrible stuff. Now, if you've got the long whisker thing going on like I do, I must Google who I got this off. Where it's from. I definitely know that Sonic the Hedgehog bad guy has it. But just a little bit of gel, a bit of VO5, gel, can you finger? You just smudge those pesky hairs that won't shake. Now you can even get the fine brush. Brush it side to side. Bring this one down, then I'll let it come back from the chin. Right. And get the nick comb. It grabs every little hair and it gives it a nicer finish. sort of flick the hairs back up where you want them to go and it'll probably take a week for them to train them cells to keep growing that way but just keep brushing and they'll get there there it's straight down out again and make sure you get all this done before your gel dries and there you have it Anyway, hopefully this video has helped you on a few products you can put on your face. Um, we've also got the moisturiser there, if you haven't seen that bit of the video yet. Now that we've totally finished, we can whack a little bit on. Just cover it in the fingers. Just get everywhere where you shaved. Doesn't matter if you get it on your forehead or your nose. Back of your neck. And hopefully... We're looking good for the day. Now go out there, score some YouTube subscribers, score some goals, and some money. Look good doing it for cheap. Anyway, catch us on the next video. I don't know what it'll be yet, but check out our previous videos. They'll be over here, up there, over there, down there. Or just subscribe, please. Push the notification bell. Helps us out tremendously. Leave a like, leave a comment. I'll hopefully get back to you. Uh, I haven't spent a lot of time on the old YouTube at the moment. So we finally got it all shaven, cleaned up, bit of gel in there, and it looks pretty neat. Um, if you want to keep going, you could always keep going and take it all off. I might do it in the next video. I might go back to clean shaven. Let me know if you want me to in the comments below. Go watch my previous video where I cut my hair. Go watch our garden videos and pet videos and Sienna's resin videos. We've got lots of content now. To subscribe and helps out. Don't forget to like, that helps out the algorithm. And don't forget to watch the whole video so that it shows retention.